Maybe I need to press something else. Heavy attack. That. Oh, cool. That's the little uh, dodge maneuver. Oh! L1 does the thing. Look at the boy go. What if I press L1 and R1? No, it just does the R1 bit. Still. What a wonderful system. I like that. It's not my character, but I, I like that. Right, onwards. The glory. And adventure. So I've got no mana flask left, and I'm down to my, my last health one. I hear somebody up there. Somebody evil. Huh. I don't know where the sound's coming from then. What we got? High night shard, sure. No problems there. See up on the cliff where some of the guys were earlier. Uh, yeah. Off we go. With just our, our sword and one flask. Truly, we are roughing it out here. Stam. Okay. Last used. We're down to nothing. Oh, wow. So that one's Scream. Like, Force Evolves? The other ones? Oh, my good God. And it calls them. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I'm leading myself into a dead end. Why would I... Why would I... Oh, of course. I can't get back up because we had a drop down. Oh, whoa. Uh, what? What? Careful on the, the corner, guys. If you take that corner a bit fast, you might fall off. That one's got crazy eyes. Driving stone, but this time as a drop. So I got no flask. I got no flask. And there's still like a caster guy over there. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. The, the enemy's screaming is a little bit. A little bit ham. It's not me, though. They're just. Whoa, that looks cool. But I don't want to die. Oh, 
Oh no! No! Why? <laughs> what an end! Oh my god, what an end! Oh dear! Wow. Okay, so all of my my quadrillion souls over there by the guy after after they all fell off a cliff. Nice. Okay, let's go stamming time. Try and save some mana. And nope. I mean, I sure I saved the mana, but at what health cost? Dear, oh dear. But yeah, not not a stream to fall asleep to. Okay, that one went a little bit better. Let's drink the potion anyway. So this guy, like some of these guys I couldn't avoid fighting anyway because they just sneak up on you from behind if you don't take them on directly. The backstab is good though. The backstab is great. These I definitely want to zap. Oh, we got clips. Nice. Hey, it detargeted him. Ooh. I feel like Dark Souls 3 does that a lot. Um, so I guess because this guy didn't scream, we didn't get the extra one from above. It's interesting. I'm sure it'll show up soon, though. Oh, he's asleep. Ah. Oh. Isn't he cute when he's asleep? Good times. Don't get the Barber Barbarian back. Um, right, let's go sneak time. Oh my god, you like said word for word what I've had happen before? Burton, were you a bot all along? You were just playing the long con? Ah, oh, it did it again, it detargeted. Oh, I lost my 5,000 souls. Yeah. Maybe uh maybe if I just block the the word discord as a list of bad words word then um I'll just defeat them all. Cuz they all want to tell you about their fantastic rates on discord.
I even saved some stamina when I was trying to just kill him with pure melee. But then he just went so crazy, it just used up all of it. But yeah, bots are bots are weird these days. They've got they've got listening skills. Like they can actually like hear what you're saying on the stream and like type back to you. A response is not a good response. It's very generic. But the fact that they can hear you vocally is just bizarre. So I'm, I missed that shot because the game just detargeted me on an enemy I could still clearly see. It was so, so annoying. Like it took one shot at the and that guy as well. It just takes one shot at them and then he targets you. It's the worst. Yeah. I got my one during like Diablo 4 when no one was watching. So absolutely empty room and then suddenly someone and it's just it's just a bot. Hopes destroyed, dreams dashed. Yeah, that's what I missed over the weekend. Like, sure I couldn't play Dark Souls 3, but I didn't have, have my guys. That's the most important part. Oh, I am so dead. Yeah. This um, red eye one's a bit of a problem. Because, you know, I've used up most of my good stuff, and then they just have, like, the best one at the end when you're out of resources. But yeah, one of, the, one of the bots was all like, okay, so what do you do for a job? And I said, oh, okay. You know, I'm, um, I I just get like, you know, the the disability money, so I don't have a lot of money. And then the very next question was, "Hey, are you ready to pay for my services? I'm running a thirty percent discount. Just tell me that." So it's just like, wow, your your bot that can listen to me just heard that I don't have any money, and then immediately the next question is, "So how much are you gonna spend in my bot store?" Ah. Oh. Yeah. How am I gonna pay someone else when I don't have any money myself? You know, maybe maybe once I have billions of viewers on YouTube and YouTube give me some of that advert money, then uh, you know maybe I can think about buying some some art. Personally, I think my thumbnails on YouTube are really, really good. Ah, oh, thanks. <laughs> just, uh, just loving them ads. But just because they're my ads and it helps me out. Yeah.
Storyteller's staff. Okay, so is my weapon a staff? Yeah, I got a sorcerer's staff. So, spell buff is one less on it. I don't know if that's anything. It weighs a bit more. It's got its own spell. Oh, my thing has a spell? Boosts the strength of sorceries for a very short period. Works well equipped in either hand. Cool. Uh, and this one has the poison spores. The other guy that this guy's been casting. Spell no noxious spores from the formless parasitical things that inhabit the staff. Ah, oh, yuck. Staff of a heretic storyteller who shares tales of the painted world. What? The painted world? Dark Souls 1 confirmed. Uh, to forlorn souls, the storytellers too are wretched beings with no place to go. Their body, soul, and even their staves are tainted through and through. If these guys are channeling the painted world, that that explains why they're they're becoming like crow men. Sick. Uh, stats required. Two more int needed. Okay. Whoops. I was supposed to do that. Yeah. If adverts can pay for my electricity, that's the bit I'll be happy about. Going too far beyond that, it's just like, well, that would that'd just be crazy. I can't even contemplate being being popular. Oh, wow, look at that stuff. Pretty cool. Huh. I wasn't expecting to get a staff upgrade out in the middle of nowhere here. Alright, let's drink, let's drink the mana flask. We don't need to worry about, you know, hitting that at the right time. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's win. Yay, souls. Gimme. Yeah, my spell is still good. Alright, I don't want to be hit by the purple, but I do want to get close. Can I just, you know, kill some of these? Please. Oh no. Did the target, but I took the steps forwards, and then it kinda it kinda worked again. Alright, alright. So this is not the glowing eyes one. Oh no. Hit a wall. I'm out of wits, biz. That might be most of the everybody. We might have won. Oh, wouldn't that be glorious? So what happened to Glowy Eyes? Like, maybe he was this one and I killed him? Yeah, they do need to relax a little. You know, maybe go see the, uh, see the masseuse. So that guy had a humanity. That was nice. I love that the, the Dark Souls one, you know, Rag kick is back. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna get some karma, and I'm gonna fall off the cliff if I if I <laughs> if I keep trying to do that. Um. So you know, let's carry on being the good guy of the story, and you know, not an evil guy that revenge kicks people off of a cliff. Um. Okay. I think one of them got to like. Keep snoring over there rather than being pulled to arms. That's good. Oh, no way. No way, no way, no way. You seeing this? It's an extra chunk of level over there. That scared the heck out of me when this guy's wing moved. Um, um, I guess let's look for a bonfire before we try and, you know, roll off of any cliffs. Oh my god, my prayers were so answered. Like, I bet that, that bonfire didn't exist in the game until I, I cried out for it while I was standing, you know, here. <laughs> Please let there be a bonfire. And then, 
shoom, on fire. I'm a little bit worried about these two guys standing nearby, though. I won't, I won't kid myself. Boss battle them bonfire, or...? Easy. Oh wow, they're wearing like the, um, cool Dark Souls armor. But they can't stop me now that I've lit it. Uh, we're not going to rest at it because I still want to roll down into that cool cave. But let's let's see what's going on with uh, Ed and Ted. Oh, hello. How do you do? I am Anri of Astora, unkindled like you. This is Horace, a friend and travelling companion. Are you too in search of the Lords of Cinder? We are well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the crucifixion woods. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep, home of the undead legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the cathedral, home of the grim Aldrich. We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. The next time we cross paths, one may find the other in a time of need. May the flames guide your way. Wow, so much to unpack there. Why did she hint that they're going to separate and they're going to need each other's help? That's a bit of horrible foreshadowing that one of them's going to... One of them's going to be in some really bad peril. But she said she's from Astora. We heard that name in Dark Souls 1. I don't know if, like, the, the, the night guy where the, the dog with the sword is guarding it. There's two kind of names that begin with A. Ah, oh, man. Uh, and then she said something else, like, uh... I think she said one of, like, the intro boss's name, like... She's hunting for that guy. One of the... One of the lords was supposed to be taken on. Oh, man, there was so much to it. Oh, yes, Horace. He's not very talkative. Don't think ill of him. He's an upstanding, kind-hearted knight, a fine partner for this grueling journey. Without his help, I would have cursed this onerous duty long ago. All right, Horace's demand. We are well along the road of sacrifices. Below us is the crucifixion woods. That's another thing. We got a woods. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep, home of the undead legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. The next time we cross paths, one may find the other in a time of need. May the flames guide your way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the first time around she said the name of like one of the bosses that's written on the back of one of those thrones in Firelink Shrine. She didn't say it the second time, but yeah, cool. Awesome. Jeepant and a, and a growl and blue sentinels. Aye, then. He sounds like he's hollowed, but he's cool. Ra 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 ra. Awesome. Um. Right. Uh. I thought it would be in this section. This um. Covenant thing, but I guess not. Oh, here we go. Blue Sentinels. Pledge oneself to the Blue Sentinels Covenant. So I get Covenant items? I think the, the, the yeah, the mount makers were, were the bad guys. Huh. Yeah, this is the guys that were making the piles of corpses, and the guy said, uh, I only do it if you're mad. Okay, so these all seem like, like online things that I'm not, you know, really doing. Summoning, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, so that's not me. Still, awesome. Let's have a little bit of a peek down this way.
That guy is carrying a bit of tree? Like a thorn? Ah, he didn't. And you can't see too much else. But yeah, awesome. Looked like there was a little bit of like a river or water down there of some sort. So the reason we weren't resetting was I, I totally think we should roll off into that, that, that crazy death cave. That you can sort of only really spot by looking backwards in the level. That's what's what's awesome about it. Ah. Huh. This is this is gonna be rough. I'm gonna drink a potion. Just cause full damage. But I I don't like the looks of this. Oh, just about. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. See ya. What? I blocked that. Why? 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 What is up with this dog? It's a bit, uh, different. What the hell? That is... That is one crazy, creepy, nasty dog. We got Morn's Ring. Oh no. Oh no. There's glowy eyes. No wonder he was missing from the combat. He's alive. And the Braille Divine Tome of Karim. Okay, so a ring and some Braille. Um. This is this is bad. Maybe maybe he's gonna be cool. Yeah, so that doesn't that doesn't go anywhere. I don't have any whizbiz left. I really don't. Um Okay. So let's look at our items. We got a ring. That's cool. Uh, boost miracles. So that's not for me. Uh, Malform ring given to the Knights of Karim. Boost miracles. Mourn served the goddess Kaitha and later became an apostle of the Archbishop. They labored together to provide comfort to the suffering. Um, and I've got a braille something or other. Learn high miracles of Karim. Sacred braille tome from Karim, filled with advanced miracles. Give to a storyteller. Are the storytellers these villainous guys? That's what the staff said. These are storytellers. Uh, to learn advanced Karim miracles in the way of the white, there is a tradition of placing great faith in the words of the blind. Braille tomes are not unusual. Huh. Okay. Gonna try and run past this guy, I, I guess. That's weird. 